guys. I got a Denver Nuggets IP recap. I got 40 autographs from them. They're a really good signing team. If you get them in the right spot, I'll explain what I mean by that. Uh, but first, in the last recap, the Timberwolves recap, I forgot to show my Zach Levine to 11 by 14s so that I got done. So I got the UCLA one right there. Kind of gave me a sloppy autograph, but, you know, that's that's what he's been giving out lately. And then I added him to the slam right there. Gave a better autograph there. So, yeah, I got him on two. And then now into the... Sixers I got from the Nuggets game. Got Nerlens on a card. Uh, this was this is going to someone. That's why I got him on a card. It was a consignment. And I got MCW on an 8x10 of him and Oladipo. That looks nice. The two best rookies from last year. Then I got Jason Richardson on 8x10. This is on consignment too. So I got both of them done for you. And then for your Nuggets cards... Uh, the only guy that signed pregame was Danilo Gallinari, so this team sucked pregame, but I got all my autographs after the game, and the whole team was really chill after the game. They pretty much signed everything. I'll, I'll show you who. So first, Eric Green. This is the only card they make of him, I think. I got him on a one. It's his SP Authentic College card. Then Randy Foy. He's one per, but if you ask him to sign multiples, he'll do it. I got him on various cards. I got him on two Clippers, Hoops, uh, Jazz Brilliance. A Nuggets and a Timberwolves. The trick I did with him was I said, Can you grab the Clippers and the Jazz cards? And then I went back and said, Can you grab the Nuggets and uh, Timberwolves? So he did all of them. So I had his various brands of cards. So I guess that's why. And then uh, JJ Hickson signed four for me. I gave one away though. So I, he got the, br I mean, I got the Brilliant signed. The rookie, I like his autograph a lot because he takes up the whole card and it looks really nice. And then he signed a brilliant, so he was, I thought he was tough, but I guess after the game they're a lot cooler, so they signed multiples. Uh, Gallo signed seven, he signed the Panini for my set, two Paninis from last year. Uh, the Hoops, and he ran with the gold, so that's why they're in gold. A Prestige, a Hoops, and then I got him in blue. I, this was on another page, so I went back and asked him to Nick's card. And then uh, Jameer Nelson was surprisingly really cool. He signed everything I had. He's usually one apiece, but uh, he decided to sign everything, so that was cool. And this is like the fourth time I met Jameer this year because he keeps getting traded. So all my cards are out of the way for him. And then the biggest surprise was Ty Lawson signed 8 of 8 cards for me. Two past and presents. Uh, threads. Uh, prestige. I asked him to sign all of them. He was a little iffy, but I convinced him, so I was surprising that he did it, though, so I'm happy about that. And he didn't only sign cards. I also got him on this little photo of him and Fareed right here. This is the only Fareed I got this year. It's nice and clean. It's a clean autograph from him. Uh, Lawson kind of signed sloppy because he did it quick. But yeah, it's still not. It's the it's a nicer Fareed Lawson duel. It's better than the one that I got last year. Completely sloppy pain pen failure. So I'm happy with this one. Then I got Nuggets rookie Gary Harris on two 8x10s. Michigan State 8x10s. This one kind of smudged, but it's alright. So yeah, that's pretty much it. It was a pretty good day of graphing, and see you guys later. Thanks for watching.